in classic Suicide Squad action. What did we do last episode? Just destroyed everything. Made a whole mess and walked away acting as if we're heroes. We're not heroes. We are villains. The whole backstory of like what Deadshot did to Rat, pretty funny. And I guess this is like what you guys were saying as in, you know, this series is supposed to be just nonsensical, goofy fun. They're just going to do dumb shit. They're going to fuck shit up. Then they're going to, you know, walk away and everyone's going to be like just baffled on what's going on. The actual plot though, uh, what's going on right now? Two different sides, right? We have the Empire side. Then there's like this other kingdom that has like also Isaka characters and Katana is a part of it. Same with Rat. Let's see what's going to happen in today's reaction. Finally! Yo, what is Joker doing, man? Cheese? <laughs> Harley Quinn lap pillow. You want to get rid of society's trash? He's always just so philosophical. Is Joker ever going to show up? Maybe not. We got our drip back, though. Are we locked up in another cell? Seriously? I swear to God. This is our third time being in the jail, like... See, like, before we got used to God, it was a jailbreak. Well, it was not a jailbreak, they let us out of the jail. And then we immediately went into jail, and then we broke out. And now we're back in the jail again, alright. Yeah, we did destroy the entire place. Still counting, he's still counting. Oh, it's the princess! That looks like Harley. もしあこの国のお姫様から。うん。ピオネ姫。ゆらいは何かだ。ざ、ざ、ウィズ。ウィズ。ウィズ。ウィズ。ウィズ。ウィズ。ウィズ。ウィズ。ウィズ。ウィ
Once it's already, you know, gone up, it's too late. You gotta go to Turkey for hair transplant surgery, bro. You gotta get that shit on luck. Get on Propatia every day. Uh, Elf, wolf dog thing, poor kid, and princess. Hmm? How dare you hang out with the commoners? Yeah, I thought that hero snitched. I thought that hero snitched. Good guy, hero. Hands are dirty. L royalty! Queen sucks! What is her duty? Good point. Does she actually believe that? Her purpose is to end the war? I mean, shit, good luck with that. It's never happening unless you need a suicide squad. Gravestone of... You don't have to worry about the price of bread anymore. It, it's, it's really messed up, but honestly, if there was no better future possible, this might be mercy. Him just like, being able to not suffer and exist anymore in this shithole where there's no hope or future. Maybe, you know, he could have been so, you know, have made salvation, but like sometimes it's like, this is a mercy in a sense. Your hair! Cecil! Propatia doesn't exist in this world. Okay. What the? Not CGI, I'm impressed. Bald. Okay. It's simple. Just break the kids out of the jail again. And, and, and is it is it gonna repeating thing where like Suicide Squad will get out of the jail to like serve a mission as soon as they're done, they fuck it up so badly while kind of you know checking off the boxes for the end of the mission and then they get put back in the jail and then threat shows up and they're like, what are we gonna do? Well shit, we gotta let those kids out of the jail again, you know? Harley. なんで私たちこの扱いなの?ブレの口の聞き方に気をつけろ。うん。ちゃくちゃにしておきながらよく言う。え?まさか処刑されちゃうとか。橋に方法を持っていると言っていたな。この軍勢を率いているのは誰だ
and the timer only exists for us, the other people got it. Free us! That's the dialogue Joker was having with Harley Quinn in the intro. How? No, you're gonna be put back into jail after this mission. You are not gonna bear the responsibility for anything. These two right here, these two fucking boomers are the worst, dude. All they do is talk high shit thing. Oh, this is the war council. Fuck you. What have you done? They've never been on the front lines. They just got here probably through nepotism. Trash. People like them are the reason why everyone's de you know, defecting to the empire. Just free us. We're your best soldiers. Come on. <laughs> yeah, we do. We do deserve to be in jail though for this. Right? Like, the... the, the we're not supposed to do this. We fucked everything. <laughs> I don't blame them for putting us in jail. Like, come on, right? Let's not be shameless here. Oh, it's the people that we were partying with in the prison. <laughs> His name is Beanstalk, the nickname. That shot's still not here. Okay, Michael Jackson. <laughs> he sets up barriers? Okay. We're setting stuff up. Yeah, where's that shot, man? What kind of... Oh, what an analogy. Weak. Weak willed. Harley's scratching her ass there. As harsh as this sounds, she's probably right. You know, it's just like the Hime does seem like stuck in a pity party where it's like, oh, woe is me. I care about, you know, the people so much and I want to do so much, but I can't because I'm so weak willed and the queen is too much. Harley's being mean, but like, she's not wrong. You know, if you want to actually enact changes on your ideals, you wouldn't just be, you know, whining and just being self-loathing the entire time. And she knows the best because she's been through the exact same thing, right? Quite often, the people that hates other things is quite often like, they see a version of themselves in the past that they hated and they've changed. And therefore, if they see some somebody that's going through the same shit they were, they kind of get upset and it's just like, I, I know exactly where you were. And you're doing the exact same thing that I've been doing. It just kind of hurts me inside. So I'm going to fucking, instead of being supportive and that, I'm going to lash out at you. <clears throat> now, now we can smell good. Okay. That's a lot of cobalt looking things. I'm thinking. <laughs> He's actually gonna be bald by the end of this season, bro. He's way too stressed, dude. He's actually gonna lose all his like, like, like because the show intentionally made him a balding hero, and because they've also made balding jokes. Right? Not me yelling bald, but the show itself is like, you know, making fun of the baldness. It would be so funny if by the end of this, he's so stressed out that he loses all the fucking hair. <laughs> Alright, hold up. Switching the headsets. Now, I wonder how much of that is true or a myth, right? Quite often you're told that like, if you're so stressed out, you're gonna get bald. If you're really stressed out, you're gonna get white hair. But I feel like, I don't know the science behind it. I feel like that's bullshit. It's a myth. I feel like much of the balding is all just genetics, right? I feel like just because you're super stressed, maybe there is some correlation of like, 
you know, balding, but male ball part, uh, b male ball, b balding, uh, what's m male hairline pattern, balding hairline, whatever the fuck that is. It's like a genetic component that's actually passed on. So I don't know. I've seen plenty of stressed out people have perfectly fine hair. I've seen plenty of relaxed people be completely bald by the time they're like in high school. It's just genetics, right? We'd love to actually understand like the science behind it though. Huh? Isekai character? <laughs> That's that rat, right? Is it? It is him. It's Rat again. He used the same staff to control before. Uh, we have a bunch of shit set up by Clayman. Clayface. Wow, good speech, hero. Alright, let's go. Deadshot's still on the roof, man. Deadshot! Someone sniped! Soga King! Did he just miss? He didn't, right? No, 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 no. He doesn't miss. He never misses. That was intentional. What did he shoot? It's a staff! It's a staff! Yeah, 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 yeah. It's busted, it's busted, it's busted. Oh. Now, you know, the other animal beast guys can't be empowered to be controlled. That was smart, that was smart. What did you just say? What did you just say? That's very racist, man. Very speciest. Yeah, the staff, right? He did some shit in the rooftop last time, too. Magic gear! I thought to a certain extent that was like a what's it called like a boosted isekai power that was allowing him to do that but I guess it was just all the gear huh Bramo. it was all a bait Clayface went out there and just wasted so much time everyone just wasted so much time that's why we never gave a fuck we're just like yeah we're just in the back lines just chilling we'll offer support but the real plan no one knew and now they're gonna turn on him I mean, he just like said a bunch of slurs to the furry people. What are you having? You were just insulting him. Not buddies. This is actually really sad. Now, I want to say get fucked, but he might literally, you know, get fucked. I, I, I hope none of them are in heat. Joker. <laughs> the rats? <laughs> the idea of killing rats is to make them fight each other and cause chaos and let them all die? I mean, that's kind of what we're doing with the rat and the rest of the furries, right? That's a deranged smile, man. That's actually scary. This whole soundtrack right now with Harley just smiling like that, it's actually disturbing, man. Are they capturing the DC Harley right now in all her glory? That shot never misses. No, you didn't. He's so unaware. <laughs> he really thought he was doing him a favor. He really thought he was the nice guy, man. They have no desire to fight, right? <laughs> no bloodshed needed. Everything and nothing. We're running out of time to reset the timer on a bomb, man. Accept it. <laughs> and then just like old fashioned, like Suicide Squad, we walk off into the sunset after solving everything. And Cecil and the rest of them are just left dumbfounded of what just happened? What the fuck just happened? <laughs> the queen should be pretty impressed at this. 
セシル団長用ですおお<笑> Why you not happy boomers? These fucking nobility bro They don't actually care It was never about like our side winning It's about making them look bad Like these dudes suck bro If they were truly like you know passionate about their jobs and protecting the kingdom This should be a This is, this is a huge dub They don't care What? Why are you giving me this angle? Whenever anime characters have this front camera angle, it's like a serious mind break moment. What? What'd she say? Oh no? Is she just super shocked that like the events of what just happened? I'm not fully understanding what the queen saw at the end, but that is the episode. Another episode where there were all these planning and, you know, clutch and well, first of all, we were stuck in a jail cell as usual. And every episode we just started in a jail cell, but now we didn't really mess anything up this time. I think that we'll be able to get away, right? The whole thing between Harley Quinn and the princess is to kind of show a contrast between the character Harley used to be and who she is now. And maybe you know, she'll be able to teach the princess, you know, how to live for herself and her ideals rather than being a self-pitying, whining loser that's just making excuses because it's impossible because my mother rules this place. The queen sucks. I'm not sure if she's supposed to be some kind of like... Like, like maybe she could be positioned like a character that has to make really difficult choices and you can't really fault her, but nah, man. She's the entire reason. These nobles, are the queen, they make up this entire kingdom and the reason why everyone left and defected into the empire. Like, it's a total L on them. We need to get rid of all the roaches in this cabinet, man, if you want any type of reform. Will the Suicide Squad help them do that? I'm not sure. We gotta get to the fucking gate, though, and reset our timer, and that's it from me. If you're still here, if you didn't enjoy this reaction, please like the video, check out the other playlist for more content, and until next time, take care.